What's up, y'all? Joe. I forgot to set up my coffee maker last night, so I'm drinking some carbonated drinks that I still had from when I moved from Sam's Club. Fuck it. Need my caffeine in the morning. Hmm. So Paul had like a fan meetup on uh, August 8th. That was a Tuesday. And like, uh, it was like around lunchtime, right? So this whole thing was like, he didn't want it to make it like a big thing. He wanted to make it as small as possible, right? So yeah, actually, so it was a good idea because for the most part, the people that showed up, they just showed up on their lunch lunchtime, which was good because they just showed up. They bought, they got what they want. They asked some questions, took a picture here and there, and then they left, right? So basically what he wanted and then it happened, right? But uh, the thing I want to talk about is basically um, what I learned from myself <laughs> as I did this shit. Now, obviously, it's, I'm at a point now where Paul people recognize me as Paul's editor. So, for people at first, like it was like, okay, I was just there, and like people didn't know who I was, right? When I started working with Paul, and they'd be like, "Hey, can you take a picture with me and Paul?" I'm like, "All right, no feelings, sir, right?" But now it's at a point where it's like my natural reaction will be like, "Okay, I'll just step aside as they take a picture." But now they're like, "No, you gentlemen, man, come on, you're part of the Paul's team or whatever." And like, I'm like, "All right, cool." <laughs> that like. um Acceptance now that I'm part of Paul's channel is uh, pretty cool, I'll admit. So asking, having people ask for my picture is uh, definitely kind of new for me, I'll admit. So it's nice, it is appreciated, right? The one thing I'll admit that is somewhat, uh, I won't say embarrassing, but it's more of like, I was definitely do not want to hide, is the fact that I don't know shit about tech that much. I mean, yes, I work for a tech channel, but, you know, my whole background is uh, construction, you know, as a construction worker, and looking for work i ended up working for a tech tuber right now over the years of working with paul i did like learn to like appreciate technology understand how things work a bit better right but because it's not necessarily something that's mainly my um high interest in the sense of like i like to learn everything about tech in the sense like you know the materials that they use the voltage the fucking the speed of things and i don't know what a lot of this shit just goes over my head right Thankfully, I'm in a position that because I work for someone like Paul, he has access to pretty high-end uh, technology, so I can look at it, be around it and stuff like that, and when the time comes, my Paul, you know, he helps me out big time by upgrading, you know, my, uh, my hardware, right? Now, if I was to, like, buy my own stuff, I do know enough now that I know what I need, and I can buy my own, like, um... You know, computer if I need it, right? Because I know exactly how things work enough for what I need, right? And I think that's where like the things people don't really understand. You know, people like uh, when it comes to like content creation, at least I'll speak, I'll speak for myself. You really don't need like the the, the greatest high end product, right? There's like a usually when it comes to like editing, usually at least for me, like the main thing that's important is like uh, uh, RAM and GPU memory amount. So like VRAM and DRAM. Yeah, those two things are pretty important, right? You want to have like as much as possible. Uh, now, in regards to like, uh, you know, CPUs, as long as you're like the highest amount possible, you know, you, you should be fine. Like CPUs nowadays, I mean, like, I think you can get like a six core, 12 thread CPU. That's pretty good, you know? You can probably get a higher one. You know, AMD does, does pretty well in getting like a pretty budget friendly, like uh, CPUs with a high core count. You know, you want to get like uh, the highest core count possible. Doesn't have to be the fastest, but you know, it can be like the highest possible, right? So you wanna get that. And with the GPU, again, you can get like a very basic like um, entry GPU, but like at least what I suggest is just get like what's current market, right? So you can have like the, new, the newest drivers and all that good stuff. But you wanna have like a, a GPU that has like a high VRAM. I suggest get close to 12 gigabytes of VRAM, you know, when it comes to GPUs and shit like that. So anyways, the point I'm trying to get at is that like, um, I like Paul that he knows a lot about CPUs and megahertz and I don't know what the fuck and like the chipset and all that shit. That's not me. <laughs> so when people come up to me and they start talking to me like, oh, what CPU do you got out with your V-band, this and that? Do you have an overclock water cooled and I don't know what the fuck. I'm like, dude, I don't fucking know. Talk to me about software. I'm all about that. I'm more about, I'm the software guy. I love software, right? I can talk to you about that shit all day, right? How I do things and this and that. <laughs> I'm definitely more on the software side of things, right? But when it comes to a hardware, like literally I'll forget what kind of CPU I have. You know, people ask me, oh, uh, you're using Th Threadripper, right? I mean, that I know. Like, what's, what Threadripper was it? I'm like, completely forgot. <laughs> Why? Because I'm just more focused on fucking like the software and how it performs and works and this and that versus like how my computer's performing, right? So, <laughs> I totally forgot. I mean, looking at it now, I mean, my CPU is a 2920X 12-core processor. processor. 
Um, the one that I got in my new uh, build that Paul has, I think it's like a 36. Yeah, I think it's like a tw it's an Intel with a 24 like thread core count processor. You know, like I don't know at this moment. Like I said, I just like that's the thing. Like I'm so fucking like busy every day, focused on getting shit done. And, like in my end, like I guess my main like uh, focus is like as long as the shit works, I'm good. Like. Ah, that's mainly it. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, yeah, so I guess that's something that I guess I want to like talk about in this video. If you meet me, if you, if you want to like talk about hardware, you're gonna be disappointed. That's for fucking sure, right? But you want to talk about software and what I know and this and that? Hey, I'm, I'm the guy. That's for fucking sure. But anyways, that's all I have to say. <laughs> it was a fun meetup. You know, thanks for the guys that showed up to Paul's place and like, uh, you know, uh, his video should be up in his channel by the time this one goes up, I think. Anyways, thanks. <laughs> Peace.